man, has it been a while since I've been able to get in here and do anything. But if any kind of stuff, as if anybody's going to watch it, <laughs> well, it's what it is. But I uh, wanted to let you know that I have finally, as far as radio goes, uh, I have built myself a tilt over mast or tilt over tower, whatever you guys want to call it. Got tired of the wind threatening my system, so I uh, came up with this. It's not perfect. A lot of people may not like the way I went with it, but uh, it works for me. I can have this thing down in roughly two minutes. Um, same thing for going back up. Um, it's safe. It's rock solid, and it has yet to give me any kind of problems. So I'm going to take you out here, kind of show you what we got, give you an idea of how, you know, if you want to put one together, you're going to do this stuff. And it, it was way less than 100 bucks. You walk up to it, you can see here that it's not, not extremely tall, but I do have 56 feet to the tip, which is pretty pretty nice to have. Uh, had great reports on it. It does extremely well. I want to apologize for the guy cutting grass over there. But here's here's the setup. We've got a crank, just a regular old boat winch, and of course the cable runs up to the top there. This is just a sandwiched four by four post. Is all it is. I extended it. It stands about 19 feet tall, and up there in that at the end of it is a, uh, a pulley where the cable runs across, comes down to this. And then on the other side, we have a two inch pipe running all the way up with LMR 400. And at that point, I don't know if you can see it or not, there is an eye hook where the cable runs through and attaches to that. So when you release it, to let it down is simply sitting on a really heavy hitch or heavy hinge down here at the bottom bolt it in and it just lays right out across the yard lays out this way get it down you have to, i have to take the two right side radials off and once those radials are off and they're just phillips head screws uh it lays completely flat on the ground uh, goes up like I said I can take it down less than two minutes that's taking the radials off also and same thing for setting her back up um, it doesn't flex much it does flex a little bit up at the top and that's something I've got to work on but uh, as far as any kind of movement or, or chance of falling this thing is rock solid man uh, there's two inch pipe but it's, it's double sleeved. There's a piece of two inch, and I believe it's either inch and seven eighths or, or uh, inch and three quarter that it's inside, that's inside of it. Uh, the joints where they do come together are staggered. So uh, I'll, have to, I'll have to draw it out or whatnot, or maybe, I, don't, I can't remember if I have, to have pictures of when I actually assembled this thing, but it is solid as a rock, man. And uh, I want to thank a couple guys. Thank my buddy Danny for supplying the pipe. Um, I want to thank my buddy Steve for coming over and help me step, uh, stand that extension up on the top of this thing. Uh, the little winch was $24, I believe it was, from, uh, from Tractor Supply. I bought a 50-foot section of 340-pound, uh, working pound uh, cable from Home Depot for 20 bucks, And then the... Uh, pulley at the top, I think it was like around, around 12 bucks. Uh, lumber I had here, so you factor in all that, say, hey, I got way less than 100 bucks in, in all of it right now. Um, I'll try to get some video later of setting it up and, and taking it down. It, it just goes really quick. Um, but yeah, simple, effective, and uh, rock solid, man. So if you're interested in it, let me know. And I'll try to get a better video of, of actually working this thing up and down and, uh, and get you a, a more detailed parts list. And uh, if I can, even a schematic of how it went together. But really simple. Did it in less than a day. 
and uh, yeah, having a ball with it. So it's a good way to keep your your system isolated from any kind of weather, isolated from the wind. Uh, and yeah, it's just uh, it's just a really it's a good it's a good safety measure to have in place as far as your radio if you care for your radio gear. All right, guys, you guys take care. We'll talk to you real soon. And until then, see ya.